All right, guys, today we're finally going to be checking out The Sixth Sense because obviously it is now closing in on Halloween and October, the scary season. I thought I'd finally check out a film that people have been telling me for ages that it is such a good film. And I, without further ado, I just want to get into it. I'm so excited. I love horror films. I love getting scared. So without further ado, before we get into this video, make sure to go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button for more videos like this. And if you want to see the full length reaction to this and all my other videos, my Patreon link will be top of the description below. Without further ado, let's get into The Sixth Sense. Yeah, so before this starts, I literally, I, I read the brief description of it and it said that a little boy can speak to spirits or something like that. And that's literally all I know about the film. Oh god, you can tell this is a uh, 90s film, definitely. There better not be a lot of jump scares in this film, because I do get jump scared pretty easily. So is this going to be the character that obviously sets up the uh, ghost or something like that? There's one fine frame. Hey, Bruce Willis when he had her. Proudly bestows upon its son, Dr. Malcolm Crow, that's you. Hey. Near citation for professional excellence. Hey, okay, so he's got an award. Children's psychology. <laughs> <laughs> So it usually takes quite a while for any like paranormal stuff to happen. Okay, I think. Ah! <gasps> Jesus Christ! Why are you shouting like that? I think they've just had a break in. I don't think it's anything paranormal. Dad, don't move. Don't make a sound. What? You're literally talking. He knows you're there. What do you want? Would he promise me? What would he promise? Oh my god. What? Who promised you? I was afraid. <laughs> you told me I was having trouble coping with my parents' divorce. <laughs> oh god, did he like kill his parents or something? I waited 10 years for you. I'm not giving you nothing. Jesus Christ. <sighs> you failed me. <laughs> you failed me. Jesus Christ, calm down, mate. Why are you shouting? Just give me a chance. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Jesus, our main character. Okay, our main character's. Surely he doesn't die. He's the main character of the film. Okay. So it is alive. Okay, alive and well. And is he currently just like watching all his patients? Is that Haley Joel Osment? Right. We watched him in a film of... I didn't upload it to the channel, but it's over on Patreon. We were supposed to meet today, but I missed our appointment. Sorry. Ah, oh, that's why he was watching him, because they were meant to meet. Okay. That's still weird, mate. Still weird, Malcolm. Noticed your eyeglasses. They don't have any lenses in them. They're also way too big, surely. I'm gonna see you again, right? If that's okay with you. Yeah, because you're going to see Dr. Malcolm again. You're going to have to tell him when you see all your ghosts. Or at least that's what the description said. Kid sees ghosts. Why is the handle like a ruby? So, when Cole's speaking to his figures, is he like... I don't know, does he think they're alive? Cole! Hey, your Cocoa Puffs are getting soggy. Hey, it's the mum, um, 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 uh, young, the woman from Hereditary, uh, Tony Collette. Yeah, it's definitely a young Tony Collette. She, she was great in Hereditary, so let's see if she, this was clearly way before that. <laughs> Why are you screaming? Just because all the cupboards are open? Nah, if my kid did that, Jesus, I'd be calling an exorcist. <laughs> oh, is he like pretending to be his friend or something? Like, is he like paid this guy a pop tart? Hey, baby. <laughs> yeah, your therapist's here. Dr. Malcolm is here to talk to you, Cole. 
I hit a grand slam to win the game. Everybody lifted me up on their shoulders and carried me around cheering. Aww. Are they, like, talking about their dream lives or something like that? He just wants to have friends. She wants to be a billionaire. Here's how it works. I read your mind. Hey, I'd like to see you do that. I drew a man. Got hurt in the neck by another man with a screwdriver. Yeah, but people just draw stuff. What's, what is it with people in, in horror films? Like, drawing bad pictures and then getting really told off. Same mannerisms, same expressions, same things hanging over their head. Wait, who? Is the guy that shot? Is he, like, comparing this boy to maybe the boy that he tried to help? I know that I've been a little distant. I... Jesus, at least talk to him. Because she doesn't look at me like everybody else, and I don't want her to. I don't want her to know. Know what? Yeah, what, what do you want her to know? I'm a freak. Why is this guy a freak? There's definitely so many comparisons between this guy and the guy that shot Malcolm. I mean, it, it does just look like lens flare, mate. Like Pre-association writing is when you take a pencil in your hand and you put the pencil to a piece of paper. Oh, there's the rainbows that he's been drawing. But I feel like she's going to find a picture that like isn't rainbows, obviously. Have you ever done any free association writing, Cole? Um, what the actual hell? No, 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 that's weird. I don't remember. Hmm. Can you do something for me? Uh, I don't feel like it's actually Cole. I feel like some ghost is haunting him. I don't know if I can deal with the Amish today. You can't curse or spit or anything around that. What? Has some guy come round or something? What? Your husband's literally in the basement. Keep moving, cheese dick. Yeah, why the hell are you going back and forth, back and forth? She literally has a husband. Goodbye. I'll give you a hint. It's the city you live in. Philadelphia. Right, right. So Philadelphia used to be the capital of New York. Fair enough. Now it's uh, Washington, not New York, America. Now it's Washington DC, isn't it? But it's cold. They used to hang people here. Yeah, of course he knows that. Of course he knows where all the public hangings were. Uh, Cole, this this building was a legal courthouse. Exactly. Laws were passed here. Some of the very first laws. No, of a courthouse a hundred years ago will have been the uh, stockings. I, uh, I I don't know how else to look. I... Oh God! No, You're he's... a stuttering Stanley. Oh God! How does he know that? Stuttering Stanley! Stuttering Stanley! Stuttering Stop. Stanley! Imagine belittling the teacher like that. Stanley! Shut up, you freak! Jesus! You can't talk to a student like that. That is disbarment. Goodbye. She knew she loved you from the first time she met you on the street. Yeah, that's the best kind of love when you just know that you're gonna be together like the first time you know them. I'm sure, I'll find someone one day. Did he not know? Well, clearly not by the look on his face. Do you not have the key to your own basement? You hid in one of those purple plastic tunnels and didn't come out. <laughs> Chucky who? Cheese. It's a kid's place. Excuse me. How do you not know what Chuck E. Cheese is? I'm not even from America and I know what Chuck E. Cheese is. <laughs> um, is Pennywise coming or something? Are we gonna get a Yo Float 2, Yo Float 2, Yo Float 2? Bill Skarsgård's just sat up here like, Hiya, Cole. Master's horse. Open this door and I'll break through it and grab you. Uh, uh, no, 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 no. That is definitely not a human, is it? Because there's no horses here. Okay. It's called Locked in the Dungeon. Yeah, Cole, and uh, you get to be the one locked in the dungeon. No, 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 that's horrible. Don't just lock him in the room. No! 
Oh look, Cole's gonna be able to see the ghost in there, right? Honestly, I would throw these two kids down the stairs. What happened to my child today? Something was happening to him, physically happening, something was very wrong! Well, no, he can see ghosts, that's what's wrong. Also, this guy's a psychiatrist, why is he always around? Okay, some twists. Like what is, that, is that like foreshadowing that there's gonna be like a massive twist at the end of this? Doesn't like the person that he's become. They barely speak anymore. They're like strangers. You no, know, like they had no interaction at all. Like literally no interaction at the meal. Like she didn't even look at him hardly. You can help this new boy. Be like helping that other one too. Yeah, I told you he saw a comparison between Cole and I've forgotten the man that shot him. I see dead people. How did I know that line was coming? I bet no, I have seen that. They only see what they want to see. How often do you see them? All the time. I knew he was going to say that. But what do you mean they don't know they're dead, so they could just be going about their normal life? They're suffering from visual hallucinations. No, Paranoia. I don't know if they're hallucinations. Maybe you can actually see dead people. There was definitely a voice in that cupboard, wasn't there? So when are the uh, horror moments going to start in this film? Because so far it's just been a normal film. Yeah, uh, yeah. I I'd like to talk to you about your boy and his friends keeping their goddamn hands off my son. So she's just thinking that it's obviously the guy, right? Like the bully at school that's hurting him. Why did he just run so weirdly? Oh, this is a thermostat. This is the thermostat, it, it, the, the, the temperature... Is, OH MY GOD! Oh, Jesus Christ. Why? I, 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 I mean, I did say there's not enough horror aspects in it. It wasn't even a scary jump scare. But when you're talking like this, everything just gets amplified. Mama? No. Dinner is not ready. What? What are you gonna do? You're not mum. Go! Mommy! Wait! Is it a bit like the start scene in The Conjuring 2? Where he kind of, he becomes the dead person? Tommy Tomasimo acted in a cough syrup commercial. He said everyone was self-conscious and unrealistic. He said the place sucked big time. But why is this guy here? Like, why is he at his school? Why is he at his house? Why is he at the hospital with him? Why is he just following him round? Does he not have his own life and other kids to, uh, you know, see? Oh my god! Oh yeah, he said, didn't he? He said people got hung here. Sometimes you feel it inside, like you're falling down real fast. But you're really just standing still. What are you on about? This kid, like I said in Artificial Intelligence, if you guys are on Patreon, you'll know what I mean. This kid is so creepy! It's cold. Yeah, it's cold in here right now. No, 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 no. I'm not surrounded by ghosts of like reaction YouTubers. Am I? They're all just sat here on my bed reacting to the horror movie with me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, pumpkins. Me and Ava will have to be carving pumpkins soon, won't we? Pedia Ease Cough Suppressant. Gentle, fast, effective. <laughs> I need bloody cough suppressant to be fair, but it's, it's mainly when I laugh I just have a cough attack these days. Tell me baby, I, I, I won't get mad honey. Did you take the bumblebee pendant? At this point you kind of have to admit it. You can't be like, oh yeah, a ghost moved it. Hey, come on. I'll show you where my dad keeps his gun. Come on. Why? There's no way his dad's gun's still there. A new person lives here. Why are you shaking? Cole, what's wrong? Uh, would she believe it? No one's ever gonna believe it. Like, I don't understand. After all these horror films, 
Surely in the real world people believe that. Why don't you try it on and see how you both feel about it? He's just like, well, I'm not spending my money. If you want it, you buy it. That's what I've been like. Like, honestly. I think maybe when people own things and then they pass away, a part of themselves gets printed on those things. Like... What is this woman on about? She's honestly... I swear they just hired her in this film to talk absolute random garbage. Not more than anything. I don't know. Told you what I want. Oh, is this this is um wait, this is Anna. I wanna be able to talk to my wife again. The way we used to talk to each other. Oh Jesus, okay. I can't be your doctor anymore. Is he not here? I paid enough attention to my family. What? Is yeah, he dead? Happen when you do that. Cause the only person he has interacted with this entire film is Cole. Except from right at the start. Did he die from the gunshot at the start? Don't give up. You're the only one who can help me. I know it. I can't help you. Yes, you can. But not for the re- No, no. Is he actually dead? Because when he was having the conversation with his wife at the table, she didn't look up once. He hasn't interacted with Cole's mom. He hasn't interacted with literally anyone. <laughs> Nah, no, that, that, oh my god, that genuinely sounded like Cole. Oh, is there gonna be something there? No, don't jump scare me, please. Wait, is that what, is that the words that Cole was saying to the soldier? Is it Latin? Wait, so has he realised that Cole was telling the truth? Want to be a Lance Corporal and Company in 3rd Battalion, 7th Marines? <laughs> what is this guy on about? Why is he always such a creepy little kid actor? I want you to think about it really carefully. What do you think they want? To help him. To help. That's right. Jesus Christ! Oh my god, he actually is one, isn't he? He genuinely is one. Well, like this guy here now would recognize him staring at the back of his car. Hey! Hey! See? Another time that you weren't hurt. Oh god, the breath, the breath. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. I'm ready for the jump scare. No, don't hide. Remember what Malcolm said. You have to face it. You have to listen to them. They're going to be in here, aren't they? <laughs> Holy shit. No, 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 no. They're coming in. Ah! Oh, my God. Why? 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 Oh, is he going to listen to her? Is he actually going to see what he's trying to say? She's trying to say. Of course you go to this building. This is definitely where the uh, ghosts live, isn't it? Like, no parent would just let this guy. That's why I mean, that's why he's, that's why I think he's just not here. Don't go home, okay? I definitely won't. So what has she asked him to do? Ah! Oh my God, why, why, why? Why are you here? <sighs> Jesus Christ almighty, why? Why couldn't you have just walked out and handed it? Surely this is going to be so weird if he just is walking around something from her bedroom and someone sees and it's like, isn't that my daughter, she's the thief. Are you curious, Daddy? What the hell's... Oh no, it's Malcolm at the back. I was like, what is that guy staring at behind? And then I realised, oh god. If I was a dad, I'd be like, who are you? Like, what? Why? 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 How about this? We can dance for a little bit, and if you don't like the way I dance, you can kick me. Wait, why? Why did she want him to see this? Obviously, it's a nice memory for him, and like, nice to look back on it, a nice keepsake and stuff. Like, nice memory of his daughter. Wait, 
Wait, the hell is that? What? What is that? Is that poison or something? Did his wife poison his daughter? Read this? Well, I don't know. You know how you get sick in the Oh my god, mate, you better go kill her. Just shoot her. Literally shoot her right there and then. You were keeping her sick. You literally killed... Is this her own daughter? Kira, come back. No, she's not. Not anymore. Then what's Dr. Malcolm here to help him with? Himself, maybe. Like, Dr. Malcolm's been the one to guide him through it all. I don't really know. You know, when I went to school here, there was a terrible fire in the section of the theater. They rebuilt the whole thing. <laughs> yeah, I know. Oh, God. Wait. Was that? So was that one of his friends from school or something that he was just talking to? Who is pure of heart can take the sword from the stone. Let the boy try. Is Cole Merlin. Not Merlin, King Arthur. Or Arthur at this point. Oh my god, look, he lifted Excalibur! <laughs> See, that was his dream, wasn't it? I feel like Dr. Malcolm's helped him, like, just find himself as a kid. <laughs> but if he is a ghost, there's a lot of awkward scenes where people will just see him, like, talking to himself or... Maybe we can pretend like we're gonna see each other tomorrow. Well, you can though, can't you? I'm ready to communicate with you now. It's not a human dialect. I am ready to communicate. Someone got hurt. Oh god, did, so did someone die by any chance and you can see them? I see dead people. Ghosts. That's all you're gonna say. I thought he was gonna utter the famous line again. They want me to do things for them. Yeah, but one of them one time like, will be a serial killer and want you to do bad things. I would never think that about you. Yeah, but you don't believe him. Just believe him. Come on. She wanted me to tell you. Oh, please she stop. wanted me to tell you she saw you dance. Exactly. Because Cole wouldn't have seen this. She hid in the back so you wouldn't see. She said you were like an angel. Come on, you have to believe him now. There's no way he could have got this knowledge. Asked her a question. He's, if he knows the question, then you have to believe it. You said, the answer is, every day. Do I make her proud? So surely you have to believe it now. <laughs> uh, why do I feel like she's about to say, oh, how did you find this out? He's going to be like, Dr. Malcolm told me. And she's going to be like, Who, who's Dr. Malcolm? Is that his wedding ring? I see people. They don't know they're dead. I knew it. I told you. Oh my god, I did. I told you. They're everywhere. Exactly. Why is he everywhere? But even if he did think he was real, why would he always be around this one kid? They only see what they want to see. I told you. He thought it was real. Oh, God! That's why he couldn't open it. He's actually a ghost. Are you insane? Oh, my God, are you mad? I called it earlier on, though. Like, I said this. Oh, Jesus. I told you. He died, did he, from this good shot? Bollocks, so have we never seen him from the back this entire film? Needed to help someone. I think I did. Yeah, and you also allowed him to help other people. You were never second. Oh yeah, because he's she said that he put all the kids and families first. I did call it, literally, I called that. What an ending to the film, like, seriously, what an insane film, actually. Well, guys, that was The Sixth Sense, and what an insane twist at the end. Like, obviously, as you guys saw in the reaction, I called it about 
an hour in that I started to put the pieces together. I was like, no one is actually interacting with him. Like his wife didn't even look at him. Cole was the only person that actually ever saw him. Not even Cole's mum could see him or anything like that. Cole was like, oh yeah, I see them everywhere. And all, no, he sees them all the time. And obviously Malcolm's character was there literally all the time. He couldn't even get a bus journey. Well, obviously he shouldn't be getting the bus by himself. But he did, clearly, because Malcolm wasn't there. But what an insane film. Like, it wasn't the classic jump scare, jump scare, jump scare, which today's horror films are, which, to be fair, I actually liked in a horror film. Like, would you even call this a horror film? Like, there was a few horror elements. But guys, if you did enjoy this film, make sure to go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button for more videos like this. And if you want to see the full-length reaction to this and all my other videos like this, my Patreon link will be top of the description below. And without further ado, I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.